What's up guys, Rizal here and I'm back with another brand new video for you guys and today I'll be showing you guys how to make an outro. So before I actually start this video, let's see if we can get this video to 20 likes, that will be absolutely amazing. And if you're a new visitor, please be sure to subscribe as that will be absolutely cool and amazing because that's if you want to see more content such like this. So without much further ado, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is open Adobe Photoshop and then click on File, New. And then this box will appear and make sure your width is 1280, height is 720 and make sure it's pixels and resolution is 72 and background contents transparent because this is the size of your video so and then click OK. So you'll have this and the first thing you want to do is choose a background for your outro. So just pick up any background from the internet. I have chosen this already so I'm just going to drag it over here and this is the background. Holding shift just enlarge it. Click on the shift button and then just enlarge it like this so this is going to be my background for the outro you can adjust it any way you want so this is basically going to be my background for the outro next thing you want to do usually in your outro you have a video box over here so we are going to make that video box so make sure that that video box is just the same size as your thumbnails or your video size so you want to click on this rectangle button right here on your left and then just click on anywhere on the screen and make sure your width is again 1280 and your height is 720 and then click on OK. So you have this box and then just if you do if you want to make this box fill just make the fill transparent so there will be actually no fill over there and then using Control T holding shift make just resize it like that. So depending on how you want your video size to be, something like this. So that's how you can actually make a box for your video and it will actually fit perfectly. That's why I have made this way. So that's how you can actually make a video box. Next thing you want to do is just add a little bit stroke to it so that it looks, it gives a border. So here's the stroke, white stroke, something like this, make it 5, yeah. So that looks pretty cool. We have got our video box right here. So I'll just type in the text for you guys out there. So that's how it's gonna be. And then all you want to add your social media links or Twitter links and whatever else. So if I want to make my outro right now, so I'll just add Rizal like this. You can choose any font you like, but there's just a tutorial, so I'm just showing you how to make it. Just make enlarge it and something like that. And then you can add your social media links right here. For example, I take in a Twitter logo, such like this, and add it right here. So as you can see, it's blue. Be sure to hold shift or else it will just mess up. And then resize it, and then just bring it down here, something like that. So you've got a Twitter logo over here, and then you can actually resize it. I mean, just add a color overlay so that it becomes um, similar to other text right click on the layer right here and then click on blending options and then on blending options click on color overlay and make sure the color is white by clicking on it and then click ok so this color is white right now and and then you can just resize it any way you want and then type in the text again something like this um, So this is my Twitter and be sure to follow it, it's cool and amazing, yeah. So th this is my Twitter and then, yeah, so this is, you have got your Twitter right now and then you can add a Facebook link so that viewers are actually updated on where to go to follow you. So this is going to be my Facebook right here and then you can just put a Facebook logo. So here I've got the Facebook link, uh, I mean the Facebook logo and then you can just add it over here and then resize it. So resize it just to the same size as the Twitter one so that they look similar. Something like this and then also add a color overlay to it so that it becomes similar all, all the text is white. So make sure the color overlay is also white. And there you go, you have, you have got your links already now. And then you can just merge the text so that it becomes easier or group them. So I have got this together and then I have got the Twitter logo and this together. So if you group them, it, group them it actually becomes easier. So there's just a tutorial so it might not look as good but then you could just adjust it 
to make it look better and then obviously you want your viewers to subscribe to your channel and look at how it goes look at other videos so just make a text subscribe so for example just right here of course viewers want to know so that's how so if now you can actually thank your viewers for watching your videos so another text right here thanks for watching so that's another text you have got there right there and then you want your viewers to know about your previous videos so that's how you add your previous video right here previous or next video but I'll just keep it previous so and then just keep it like that so viewers actually know now that this is going this is going to be your outro and then you can just adjust your layout how you're gonna be how do you want your outro to be and just yeah for example there's the subscribe button right here you could just move it right here and yeah just just mess up around with all these things just like take the Twitter logo somewhere here and FB logo somewhere here and then make your subscribe button come up something like that and then you could actually make the thanks for watching logo even bigger so that makes your outro so this is how to make an outro guys hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did enjoy this video please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and if you guys do like this outro let's see if we can get this video to 30 likes because if we get to 30 likes i'm surely gonna put the link to this outro on the description so you can actually download this outro and use it and format the text or anything you want to so i'm gonna be linking the psd file or the photoshop file so that's all for this video guys hope you hopefully you guys did enjoy this and if you did please be sure to subscribe if you're new and also be, give it a thumbs up because 30 likes and you'll get this outro so yeah that's all about it for this video guys my name is Ryzen.